Hello again, it's Laura. So you've seen all my 3D paint tutorials, so it's all good. So today I'm doing a makeup tutorial, which I haven't done in a while because I've had a bit of a problem with this ear. So yeah. Okay, so I'm doing Anna from Frozen since I did Elsa. So yeah. Okay, so first thing I start with is the base. Do, 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 do. So I'm going to use this use my revolution star primer which feels so nice and so Ooh. oh gosh sorry oh can you smell this primer Does it smell? primer can you smell it mm. what do you think it's it's so nice. When you, yeah, when you put it on your face, it's really nice. So yeah. There we go. Finished. Now the foundation. So. Anna's skin might be more lighter than her sister's, so yeah. Okay, so I'm going to use the e.l.f. Flawless Satin Foundation in shade, what shade are you? Pearl. Alright, so for concealer, I'm going to use the Morphe Fluidity Concealer in the shade C125. Here we go. Alright, so for powder, I'm going to use the Revlon Colour Stay Powder in the shade Light Pale.
beautiful. Look how matte I Okay, first I'm going to do blush. So I'm going to use the Roxy palette, blush palette by Revolution. So I'm going to just use these two shades here. Because Anna, Anna, sorry, has the most beautiful pink rosy cheeks. So yeah. Oh, beautiful. Now, next step is highlighter. So I'm going to use my L'Oreal Iconic Glow Highlighter in the shade Coconut Addict. This actually smells like coconut. So, yeah. If you're wondering where I got my jumper from, it is from Sainsbury's TU. And also... I've got matching joggers to it so what do you guys think so today I decided to put my hair in a ponytail because it would suit me a lot better and be a lot beautiful for me because I'm quite I dress anyway I am so yeah Okay, so I'm going to do my eyes. So, Anna's makeup look is more natural than her sister's because her sister's is more like the pinks and purples. So, I'm going to use my Powerland Maximore Nude Palette. Um, oh, wow, that's a lot. That's a lot I've got. So, I've got wet wipes, which I keep handy for cleaning my brushes and wiping makeup off my face. But I am going to take would be a, for, as in like for a transition type colour. It is going to be do, 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 the more like matte nude, light nude here. There you go. Okay, and then for the next part, I'm going to use a more like darker brown to just lighten it. sort of colour, uh, a light sort of shimmery kind of 
grind it. So I am going to use my pizza palette, which um, I haven't really properly used. So yeah, so I'm going to use a special shade slice. Now I'm going to use the shade Calzone. And then I'm going to blend the colours with a like, champagne, a few champagne sort of colours. Blend away. So I'm going to use a darker brown to intensify it a little. more of a uh, bit more of a lighter brown to blend I hope I'm doing this right yeah. don't come at me if I do it wrong so mm -hmm. okay so next bit is eyeliner so I'm going to use my NYX Epic Ink Liner. It's a black one. So yeah. Right. 